Yo, yo. Working on some cable management here and getting the uh, new displays port cables hooked up. And the way this mount works, triple screens made out of 2020 rail. And in the past, uh, there's a setup like this that's offset from the back of the monitor. Uh, some studs coming out. Very janky, very, very jungle. And uh, the biggest problem was when this uh, setup was like this, the display port was barely blocked and my old cables, the head of it would, was able to fit in that gap. But the new cables, uh, that, that head distance conflicts with this rail. So there needs to be uh, some reconfiguring of this. And mainly, I, I hate to look at that how this is uh, outside of the plane of the main 8020 or 2020 rail, which prevents me from putting a black back plate up here to tidy things up. So that design is done and a little bit of a positioning has been done on this side to show what it's gonna become. These have flipped to the inside now and they are flush. Uh, using some corner brackets, M4s to go back right into the monitor. Much tighter, much cleaner, and ooh, cable management. So these are some 3D printed nylon uh, little clasps that will go inside these crevices to handle all my wires, which there is a lot of them. But uh, yeah, that's going to be sick. So in order to tidy it up more after this is all done, there will be a a backer board here. Um, I'm not sure what it's going to be yet, whether it be uh, Luan or maybe Plexi. Eh, actually, that'd be pretty cool, like a colored acrylic Plexi, a yellow tinted or some type of tinted plexiglass. Damn, that that would be that would be pretty cool. But uh, that's where we're at. Got to do uh, this one's done. Other side, the center is going to be slightly different. Uh, USB uh, dongle here. Uh, same problem. This stuff is up in and up at the display port's ass. Very hard to get in there. Uh, but since the width of that is driven by the width of the DD1, um, might have to 3D print or make some custom spacers to widen out the main tubes that hold up the assembly. But, uh, yeah. So, I'll finish that, and that's onto the roof. Probably get uh, some more ABS. Finish out how this ties back down into the master rig, rather than using the, uh, uh, uh was that foam core board. Um, it's time for some upgrades. Later.